Hey guys, it is Nikki here. Welcome to 2019 and welcome to my channel um, and uh, the first thrift haul that I'm going to post for this year. Um, I want to just say Happy New Year. I haven't been on since New Year and I just wanted to convey that message to you guys. So I wish you everything that's good for this year. I know it's what the 20 third I think my birthday is tomorrow of January so I'm looking forward to that um, it's gonna be low key actually I have been home for a few weeks because I had surgery and I'm thankful that it happened because now um, I can really go out I and live do my have life. cystic fibroids and I got uh, some of them removed so I'm grateful and I'm thankful and that was one of the things of the goals that I wanted to accomplish last year along with my divorce um, and that just came just in time it was you know in time for I heard that I was gonna do surgery in December so I got it done in January so I've been home for a few weeks and so I wanted to share that with you set your goals make sure that you work at them makes no sense uh, working towards something that is just vague be specific okay guys so I that's really my little gem enjoy you guys coming onto my channel and providing support for for my channel um i do this because i love it i don't get any kind of youtube dollars for this channel because i don't have enough subscribers they changed that sort of um incentive some time ago like over a year ago so you know, until I get to what, 4,000 subscribers? I'm doing this because I love to do it and because I love to show you this stuff. My other channel, which is Nikki Splinter 24 Naturally, you know, something like that, is my natural hair channel that has over 9,000 subscribers, but I'm not very active on there anymore. So um, I say that to say I do this because I love it. It's my sub channel and I didn't intend for it to turn out to be a thrift channel it was more supposed to be a lifestyle channel but this is what I love and I've been loving for the last couple of years so here we go um, so to bring this year into a bang I um, they had a 50% off from value village and I decided to take a look um, because it was timely I needed a few things I needed to gather up some stuff or not really I just wanted to get some stuff there so anyway I went into Valley Village got one of their recycled bags and yeah I picked up quite a so few so guys things. it is in the middle of the day but we've been having a lot of snow and so I have to put up a little bit of a lighting situation here um, because I'm not getting natural light so I was actually looking for sweaters for myself but primarily for my mom who usually takes my hand-me-downs she's a small or extra small depending um, and I was looking through because she wanted some tops for me but I didn't have any because I gave away most of my clothes and so I was looking for some tops for herself and for me so anyway I got this for her so this is a nice nice color for her it's a nice Nice woven burgundy with black knit with a single cable going down the front it is cotton it's in a medium it is from Joe Fresh and I actually showed it to her and she loved it it was one of the ones that I thought she would like and she did and she's much more petite than I am and she is few shades darker than I am too so this will go well on actually any complexion but I just thought it would be especially nice for her so this was $8.99 so I got it for $4.50 this one I got for myself to go back to work um, so it's pretty much a zipper up cardigan it is a zip up cardigan by Amarni exchange I don't know if it's women's or men's but with a zip it doesn't matter um, it's unisex in my mind and it is a size small got this for myself it was $12.99 so half of that brings it down to $6.50 and I will definitely be rocking this to work I'm not sure if my mom would like this I should have probably given offered her this one because of the neck she probably wouldn't want that but I intend to wear like a shirt I try to wear a collared shirt underneath and see how it works but this is an excellent condition it's almost brand new looking and I was happy to get it at half price 
was strolling through the men's department and I found this sweater so it's like this shirt which is kind of like you know oh my god this escapes me what this it's kind of like long john's material that kind of material which has a name but i just don't know what to say it is and so it is actually coincidentally another top from Armani Exchange which I absolutely love because it's cotton and I got it for myself just to wear casually. It buttons up the front and it has a faux leather trim on here and I just like it. It's hooded. I just think it will be cool. It's in okay condition but this is just for casual running around. What drew me to it was just the fabric itself that it's breathable and something that I can just definitely just throw on and look cute in, you know. I loved it and it was $7.49 and half off. So I had gotten this for mom and she didn't want it so I, buy, I bought stuff with the mindset, stuff that I like, that if she didn't like, I could keep. And, you know, she's a woman who I tell her not to look at size per se, but just look at the fit. So she was turned off, first of all, because it was a large. But I'm really into chenille. Chenille is actually, seems to be back this texture here if you don't know what that is it is called chenille and it's kind of like a soft knit and I love this sweater because the color I thought would be great for her but I also you know I'm not like a tassel edged person but I just thought this would be great too um, and I just like the condition of it it's just a nice gray which I don't have a lot of and it was $9.99 so I thought this was cute but she didn't like it, so I'm going to keep it. And this I can wear to work also because it's business So another there. thing I got, I found another chenille top, which I thought she would like. But it's not for everybody. So I knew, like, when she saw it, she's like, no way, this is too bright for me. But anyway, whatever. I like it because I love orange. Um, she did find a flaw here, a little hole here, but it's okay. It's not very evident. But I just love the chenille color and I love the combination of patterns. I love the fact that I can scrunch this up and it will really look nice with some nice jeans. Um, the collar kind of have a, has a open kind of mock looking collar, which is cool. And it was $5.99 and half off. So I will see. Now that I'm looking at it against in the camera, I'm like, yo, this is, yeah, mom's right. But I think I'll be able to rock it at least so once. So the thrift store is a place where I typically, if I'm looking for sweaters, I look for high quality sweaters. And um, one of the high quality fabrics is cashmere. Any wool, it, I prefer it to be cashmere because it's so soft, it's so warm, and it doesn't itch. So I found this cardigan, which has some little diamond looking buttons some are missing some aren't but it doesn't matter in this nice gray oatmeal color and i just love it it's a size large but it's great because you can really layer this up nicely and this was 9.99 it's an extra large and it is by a brand that i don't know <laughs> but it was definitely a great price at ten dollars because i got so it this price. might be a questionable top but i like sweaters that are also funky too so i picked this up this was originally from h&m so i guess it was probably put out during thanksgiving time and it says i'm not a chicken but i really really like this i just love those sequined turkey on the front and i can actually tuck in the front a little bit and so the you know the wording is not that visible or part of it but I just got it because of the bird not necessarily because of the message but um, it was nice I really don't like statement tops or anything that have writings on it but I just liked the sequence on it it's so pretty in this beautiful gold color and it was $9.99 from H&M, it, so it was $5. So continuing on, I got a slip from the lingerie section. 
and it actually has the winner's ticket on it which was it was $7.99 but I got it for $2.99 and then half off that so that was pretty much free $1.50 where are they doing that and we've had this discussion about slips guys you need to have, have at least one slip in your wardrobe because there will come a time when there's a secret C through dress or something and I just I explained that it really helps for like a skirt or dress to lay nicely on you and kind of smooth out any lumps and bumps that you might have actually so you know without wearing a girdle or something like that I'm not at a girdle stage yet but definitely I love slips so I couldn't resist this one it was cheap and just definitely something I will use also I found this nightgown which i just love it because of the color because of the fabric and just because of the length it's just short and cute and it has this little detail lacy detail on it that i really really like i just love this coral color it's just beautiful and i got this for five dollars from 9.90 nice. i was looking through the housewares and I'm finding that I'm entertaining a little bit more so I got these glasses and the reason I got them is because it has the pedestal at the bottom so you know some people just don't like to use coasters and that annoys me because it leaves that ring I mean I'm not gonna be devastated but with these even if they don't put it on a coaster it's on the pedestal so it doesn't really look it doesn't leave a mark because you have this between the the drink so you know the sweating doesn't happen so this was supposed to be four for 5.99 so they gave me a dollar off because I only found three so I love these and I will be using them and another tip for you for housewares like if you are a wine drinker or if you entertain a lot don't go out and buy wine glasses I mean you go to the thrift store you can get four wine glasses for like a dollar or two dollars like if they want to smash them up when you entertain that's fine too it's I refuse to buy wine glasses anymore anywhere else but at the thrift store so just note to sell so I also found this knife which I do own myself and it's a very expensive knife it is from JK Henkel which is a German company and I love their knives they are great quality a knife like this I did buy mine at an outlet and it was still over a hundred dollars so I was glad to pick this one up at the thrift store for $4.99 like can you believe it and it's legitimate it's a legit Henkel knife so I was happy to get this and I absolutely love it and because um, I cook I appreciate a good uh, cooking utensil. and I got this one too it's an Italian brand called Brandani inox and it's apparently Italian and so these I love these knives with this you know I needed some more knives without serrated edges so I absolutely was happy to get these two knives I'm not sure this is not too expensive um, usually but I got it for $3.99 and I think they're like 10 pounds sterling or whatever when I checked it out but I love it I love the color and I love the blade that the blade is is powder blue and yeah so I really really love that And last but not least, I got a game. I'm into games a lot lately. Well, I'm not, because you have to have company over to play games. So I try to encourage, I encourage people, people to, when they come over to play games because it's so much fun. So I found this one, Mad Gab, which I've heard about. So um, it was only $2.99 and I absolutely am excited to get this to add to my collection so we can play. Anyway guys, that is it for my thrift haul, my first thrift haul of 2019. I hope to see you again. I do have some other things that I thrifted that I need to organize. I, uh, do the video, so that will be coming up next. And those are things that I've gotten before these, including a beautiful Burberry coat. So if you follow me on Instagram at Splintablius Life, yes. 
the spoon tablet that I've, I had posted it there. So if you want to follow me there, follow me and you'll see things like that instantly. Um, yeah, so I'm going to do so those I videos. have this waiting for you so you don't have to have this long gap in between. So take care guys and have a wonderful day. Bye.